Hello and welcome to Talking in the Library. My name is LB and today we are beginning a brand new game. I actually don't know when this game came out, but it's brand new to me. Therefore, it is brand new to everyone else. And it is called Dredge. I have no idea what it's about, but it looks like it has a cool art style and it's got a boat on the cover, so I'm sold. New game. Let's jump straight in. I don't care about watching options and all that kind of stuff. I like to do that in the game so that it breaks up the gameplay and makes everything clunky for you guys. This is gorgeous. Oh my god, it looks amazing. Okay. I don't know whether this game is like a like a fishing game or like a action game or like a horror game or a mystery or like a story. I don't know what this is, even slightly. I think I've gotten vibes that it could have been any of the above, but I don't think it is. So I guess we're going in blind and we'll see uh we'll see what happens. Good lord this loading screen is taking a long old time. <laughs> Isn't it? Just any day now. Got all the time in the world. <laughs> Brilliant. Okay, Monday, day one. The morning light fills your eyes and you try to sit upright. You're lying on the cold, wet dock where you collapsed the night before. A short man is shouting orders at a handful of workers disembarking from a boat nearby. The man notices you. Welcome to Greater Marrow. I must say, quite the dramatic first impression. I see you've already introduced yourselves to the jagged rocks along the bay. Yourselves? Why did I do that? LB, you know better than this by now. Did you not see the lighthouse? It was shining right at you. <laughs> well, I'm glad to see our new fisherman upright and breathing. Your boat was hopelessly damaged, but I've had a few of the locals move your things to one of your old vessels. One of our old vessels. We'll catch up later to discuss more details. I'll let you get out there to catch some fish. See if you can fill your cargo while you get your bearings in the light. Finally. I don't suppose I need to say this, but get back by sundown before the fog rolls in. Keep a close eye on the time. It can really creep up on you. Okay, so it's 6am. Undock. Yes. Move forward with that and reverse. Okay, so I just, it's, I just use my stick. Rotate camera. Oh my god, it's like a little exploration game. How do I fish? Okay. Start fishing! Yeah, I'll start fishing. Hell yeah, I got some fish! Okay, I'll put it there. Start fishing again. Like that. Boom, put that there. I can just keep fishing. So it is just a fishing game. Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. So I just, if I just keep, do I, do the fish numbers actually go down when I'm taking them or what? Okay. The spot has been depleted. Right. Okay. Well, we got, we got what we could. Okay. So the fish numbers do actually go down. Is this an open world game? The only... Time only advances when you're moving, fishing, or taking other specific actions. Oh my god, it's like super hot, but with boats. Is that a manta ray? You don't have the right equipment for this. Okay. Right, let's... What about you? Can I fish her? Yeah, start fishing. Now... Fuck you. Fuck you. There we go. There. Nice! Species added to encyclopedia. 
uh, if I put it there, then I'll fish for another one. Pull, pull, uh, pull, pull. Sweet. So what I need to do is I need to just kind of go to a different area. Oh my god, this game just looks so cool. It looks beautiful. What is... Oh, that's the light. Okay. You don't have the right equipment for that spot. What about here? This feels really peaceful. I like this. Uh, can I rotate? Yeah, I can. So if I put that there... Wow, that was depleted real fast. Oh, it's raining. Does that mean the fish kind of go away? Select your lights by holding L1, then toggle with square. More visible. Why would it matter if I'm more visible? How far can we go? Oh shit, yeah, we should go back in. Oh, I don't... Oh, fuck. Increases your panic. Bright lights and sleeping will reduce it. Oh, fuck. Okay. Oh, damn, this game is actually quite intense. So I need to go back to the dock now and avoid smashing into more stuff. Okay. You look lost, fisherman. Are you after somewhere to sell your catch? Greater Marrow is on the west side of the bay. Keep an eye on the lighthouse, huh? Wouldn't want to lose sight of it for too long. Okay, I'll speak to the trader. You enter a brightly lit shop. It's packed with antiques, the shelves full of jewellery and other baubles. An old man peers at you over silver spectacles. Hello. Is that... No. Ah, I don't believe we've met. Forgive me, my eyes aren't what they used to be. I specialize in antiques and jewelry. I'll purchase any special trinkets you happen to have. Have you got anything nice with you today, perhaps? Oh, yeah. This? Can I... This? Have I... How do I don't I don't have any trinkets. No, I don't. I don't have any trinkets. So I'm meant to explore at night time, but I can't How do I what do I do with this? Pursuits. Catch fish for the day. You may ask me to catch as many fish as I can, then head back to Greater Marrow. Where is Greater Marrow? Map? Little Marrow. Greater Marrow. Okay. Oh my god, it is open world. And it's quite big as well. Okay. So we need to go the opposite side. Okay, so that's the encyclopedia. Whoa, there's a lot of different fish. Hadal fish? Okay, that's the map. So we're going there. What are we meant to do with this in this game? Like, I'm not actually sure where, like, what is, is there a, I'm assuming there must be a story to it or something, is there like a, I don't know, I don't, I just don't know, oh, why are these rocks just coming out of nowhere, man, yeah, I'll fish, I'll start fishing, yeah, 
Yeah, I'll take the squid. Why not? I need to fix up my boat. It's <laughs> Tuesday day two. Wow, we are taking our sweet time. Panic is uh, setting in. Cool. You step onto the dock at Greater Mero. The mayor is waiting nearby. Ah, I see you've returned in one piece. Very good. Before you head off to town, we should discuss the matter of your boat. As I mentioned earlier, your old boat was too badly damaged to be repaired. However, I'm more than happy to sell you that replacement vessel. Yours to own. I understand you may not have the necessary funds on hand, so we'll consider it a loan, but I want to make this easy for you. Until your debt is repaid, a tiny portion of your fish sales will go towards paying it off. A small amount of interest will go towards improving the town. So, to recap, you'll need to sell fish to the local market, paying off your debt and, in turn, keeping the population fed and satisfied, understand? Selling fish helps the town and pays off my debt. Got it. Yeah. Off you go, then. Sell those fish while they're still fresh. Fishmonger! You enter a squalid shack on the fringe of the marketplace. The familiar smell of fish fills the air. Flies buzz haphazardly around a downcast man behind the counter. You're the new fisherman, eh? Surprised they found a new, f new one so fast. What happened to the other one? He... It takes a certain type of person to last out here. It's not a life for everyone. Anyway, to business. I'll pay you for fish. Bigger and fresher means more money. Some species are just worth more too. Other towns on other islands might pay you different, but while you've still got a debt outstanding here, I'd suggest you'd work on paying it off first. So let's see what you got. That was a terrible Canadian accent, but I was going I was doing my best. Sell. 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 Sell that too. I'll sell that as well. That also, even that, and <laughs> that one also, boom, look at that, I am just awesome. How much debt do I have? The mayor is standing outside the fishmonger's store. Excellent work, I have no doubt you'll be able to provide for this town. Look here, I found this down by the docks. I'm sure someone like you can make something out of it. Why don't you take it? Okay. Uh. Research part. Yeah, I'll take it. I'll put it there. Oh, one last thing. Our local shipwright mentioned you might, she might be able to make some modifications to your ship. You should pay her a visit. Did I just... Was this guy just speaking with a, with a different accent? I think he might have been. I think I started him off on like a... New York and then I don't know <sighs> oh one last thing our local shipwright mentioned she might be able to make some modifications to your ship you should pay her a visit ship loan repayments $36 remaining wow I've already cut off a huge amount of stuff haven't I as you walk into the yard you see the shipwright making repairs to a damaged hull she looks up at you briefly before turning back to her work. Ah. You must be the new fisherman. I can make improvements to your vessel in the yard. Mind you, I'm not in the business of doing favors around here. Payment is up front, and everything takes some time to install. Also, if you take, in, take on any damage from the rocks, or any damage at all, I can patch it up. Mostly. Cool. She shrugs and gestures towards the hole she's currently attempting to repair. A number of wooden boards, all well above the waterline, are splintered and scratched. Take a look round. Just remember, the bigger the, equi the bigger the equipment, the longer it takes to install. So plan ahead. Get this repaired at a shipyard. Cool. That one. That one. Yeah! Uh, what is this? Oh, different kinds of fishing stuff. Research? Hydraulic rod. Oh, I've got a research point. 
catches. What does that do? Hybrid design allows for a more flexible fishing style. Hi, mechanically says reels allow the catching of significantly larger species. That one. Yes, please. So there's a lot to collect then. Like a lot. Okay. Okay. I'm liking this game. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. Rest. Resting until dawn. That's a good amount of rest. Nice. Mayor, what can I do for you? Ten dollars. Excellent. Now, what else can I do for you? Ask about the wider region. Certainly. Is there somewhere in particular you wish to know more about? Gale Cliffs? Well, the main port over there is a place called Ingfell. It's right on the approach to the cliffs. You can't miss it. It's a whaling town, but I haven't heard much talk of it these days. I think quite a few people have left one way or another. Is there another area you'd like to discuss? Stella Basin. Quite a popular tourist destination. There's a resort on the atoll, built on top of a beautiful coral reef. I'm sure there's a wide variety of fish there. Maybe you fancy getting your hooks into some of those. Is there another area you'd like to discuss? Uh, that's all for now. We can go back and see some more later. Uh, I should get back to fishing. Uh, how much money do I have? Nine dollars. Right. Okay. Whoa! This game just looks so nice. It feels so therapeutic to do. To boot. Let's do some fishing. Fishing, fishing. What about you guys? I haven't the right equipment for that spot. So I guess I won't go there. Right, let's start exploring a little bit. Let's see where... Where are we going? Let's go... Yeah, let's go over to that little island. There, these islands are like a long way away from each other. I'm imagining the game kind of forces us to move out a bit at some point. Or, or I guess. Start fishing. Pull. 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 Sweet. And then you can go there. And then start fishing again. God. Love a little fishing simulator. And then pull. 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 Nice. This is going to be such a frustrating game for you guys to watch. Because I'm just going to be having fun doing just very unentertaining things to watch. It's been depleted. Okay. Right. Well, let's move on then. Let's go see what what's up with this town. Can we dock here? Can we dock? Yeah, let's dock. What are you? Ruined mansion. Let's go to the ruined mansion. The door is locked. Workshop. The workshop looks as though it hasn't been used in decades. Go inside. It's locked. Fuck you guys. Guess I'll undock then. You guys suck. So, Devil Spine, Gale Cliff, Stella Basin, The Marrows, and Twisted Strand. Okay, so I'm assuming the little black dots are where all of the, um... I'm assuming, yeah, I'm assuming the little black dots are where all the ports are. Can I go all the way out there? Is that the edge of the map? This is crazy. This is such a cool game. I'm having so much fun. I like it. I like it a lot. So... I guess we should try and figure out if we can catch bigger kinds of fish at some point. But I want to get I want to get at least two days done, then I'll end I'll end this video. But I think realistically we should 
head back soonish, shouldn't we? I mean, it's not. The spot's been depleted. Yeah, and it's already five o'clock. What are you? What is that? Message in a bottle. Twenty-first of August, nineteen twenty-seven. Added to cabin. Okay, so it's like little bits of old history and such and so forth. I'm going fishing. Don't have the right equipment for that spot. I'm not going fishing. Oh, the fog is coming in so fast. All I need to do is not hit a rock. Okay. Which way am I going? Going to Greater Marrow on the other way. It's so far. So, so, so far for me to go. Which is why I'm going to fish instead. I don't have the right thing for that spot either, guys. So we are going to go back to Greater Marrow and go to day three. Just don't hit any rocks. But I feel like um, there's something going on here. Like, I don't think it is just a fishing game. There's definitely... I don't know. Okay, put that there, put that there. Cool, that spot's been depleted as well. I get the feeling we're probably going to end up smashing into some kind of rock. But that looks promising. What are you? Is that another message in a bottle? I love that song. 20th of August. Is that a shipwreck? Probably shouldn't go there, am I right? Yeah. Rocks everywhere. Good God. Start fishing. Gonna have so much. So much fish. So much fish. I'm going insane though, so I will be sleeping until the next morning. Something slithers into your cargo hold. What? A hunched woman approaches you from the steps of the lighthouse. She stops in distance away and looks at you with concern and visible apprehension. Why are you here? I've come to fish. There's nothing here for someone like you anymore. Do yourself a favor and move on. She turns and shuffles back along the path that leads to the light. <sighs> if you can fulfill it, I'd, I'll pay you above normal prices. Tell me about the order. Pursuit added. They asked for one gulf flounder and one grey eel. Just bring them in one, when you have them. You'll need to have a rod that can handle shallow water fish in order to catch those. The shipwright should be able to sort that for you. Uh, how do I sell all fish? Easy. Don't let yourself get too worn down. We'll need you well rested to provide for this town. Hmm. Oh my, you look exhausted. You're not forgetting to sleep. Get some sleep, are you? As I always say, taking frequent breaks is an important part of being productive. Oh yeah, I'm going to get some sleep because everyone's saying I look like shit. Okay, well, it's day four. Mayor, just the person I was hoping to see. Will you be sailing out east towards Little Mara? Would you give this package to the dock worker there, please? Yep, I can. The mayor hands you a small, damp package bound in string. It's dripping slightly. The dock worker will pay you upon delivery. Please be quick about it. I don't want it to spoil. Don't forget to check your compass and map if you get lost. Hold on. 
I'd like to pay off some of my debt. Of course, I'm sure I'd like to pay all of it. Fantastic. Now, what else can I do for you? What happened to the last fisherman? Hmm? The last fisherman? Oh, he was very unreliable. He'd go out at night, come back with no fish, and proceed to sleep all day. Oh, fuck. Time management's gonna be a big one here, I reckon. Okay. <laughs> He was also a terrible captain. I mean, really terrible. Constantly running aground on the reef, even in broad daylight. The shipwright almost ran out of wood for repairs. No, he was no good. One evening he left and never came back. So long, he shan't be missed by us. Now what else can I do for you? I should get back to fishing! Thank you! Anyway, I'm going to leave it there for this video, and I'm gonna go and, uh, get some, get some rest myself. But I will see you in the next episode of Dredge, which will be next week, the same time as today. I hope you guys have been enjoying it. This has been Talking in the Library. My name has been LB, and I am Audi.